Now we're here at Pilot Careers Live London and we're joined by Lucy Sylvester and Guy Bowen from British Airways. Thank you very much for joining us. Can you just give us a quick intro into what you both do? Hi, um, I'm Lucy Sylvester. I'm the Pilot Recruitment Manager at British Airways. Um, so I'm responsible for making sure we have a pipeline of um, pilots available for both BA and Euroflyer. Uh, I'm Guy Bowen, I'm a uh, long haul pilot with BA, uh, been with 16 years and joined the recruitment team where I did assessing and interviews for the past six or so years but have formally joined the recruitment team in the last six months helping Lucy to manage the campaigns and uh, following our candidates all the way through to joining on the line. So Lucy, what's the current status of pilot recruitment at BA? So currently we are recruiting uh, direct entry pilots, so you need 500 hours or 100 sectors on a ZFT compliant aircraft, and that's both for BA and Euroflyer. And then City Flyer um, have also got their DEP campaign open, same requirement, but they are also looking for low hours pilots as well, so um, great opportunity. Um, is open at the moment, but we've been, City Flyer have been slightly overwhelmed with the number of applications, so it might close sooner. A guy, a question that comes up a lot is modular versus integrated. Yeah. Does that have any bearing on somebody applying to BA? Short answer is absolutely not, no. Uh, we appreciate that all of our pilots or applicants come from different backgrounds. Uh, there is a different cost, obviously, we know between modular and integrated. There's also the time frame. Uh, the key thing for us, though, is obviously have a license, a UK license. And what we do look for is a good performance. Wherever, however you've chosen to take the route uh, that you passed your ground school exams, uh, we allow for one uh, retake. Uh, but more importantly, all of your flying tests are passed in the first series. So in chance, no, it doesn't. Uh, however you get here, as long as you reach the standards. And other than the sort of experience that's listed on job adverts, what other kind of personality traits make a good pilot at BA? So, more and more with flying, and I've done it in my career, is we're looking, our pilots are very much our frontline ambassadors along with our crew. Um, so we're looking for good team players, people who can communicate well, uh, they're up front with the, with the passengers, how they deal with the passengers. Uh, so I think that would probably be the being proactive and engaging is probably the best traits you're going to have as a BA pilot. Um, and what sort of message would you both want to communicate out to people who aspire to join BA as a pilot? Um, be determined. Um, if you don't make it in first time, give it, you know, try again. Um, we are not every pilot who applied the first time gets in, so be determined. Yeah, I, I would say never give up. Uh, a lot of our pilots now that come and join us, we aren't their first airline. Um, that opportunities are now arising for us to become the first airline again to uh, young pilots. But if you have gone down a different route doesn't mean you can't end up with British Airways at the end and there's a long career and a very varied career that you can have as a pilot within BA. Right well thank you both very much I'll let you get back to the stand because it is a busy day. It is a busy day thank you.